guys, I'm Tina Guo and I am here today to tell you about my top five, five, uh, side hustle ideas. Number one, consultation or lessons. So whatever it is that your area of expertise is, I myself am a musician, so I give career consultation sessions uh, and cello lessons, both online over Skype or FaceTime or, or in person. So that is something that you can advertise. You can tell your friends and family about it by word of mouth. You can post on your social media pages, um, and it is a great way to reach out to your network. Number two, sell things on eBay and Craigslist. So go through your garage, go through your closet. Is there anything that um, is in good condition and is usable and you're not actually using it? Maybe it's, you forgot that you had it there. Dude, sell it. So uh, another thing you can do is to actually buy and sell. And a lot of people do this. So um, you can go to garage sales, swap meets. Uh, you can even find things on Craigslist and sell them again. Uh, my biggest success <laughs> in that was back in the day. I did a lot of this buying and selling on Craigslist. So two things, I bought this like a uh, surround sound system for $40 uh, cash off of someone because he was moving in with his fiance and they both had the exact same sound system. And that sound system was worth a lot more than $40. So I, uh, I bought it for 40, sold it for $250. Um, I think about a year later after I used it for a year. So it is totally possible um, to actually use something and then sell it and to make money from that. Um, and then something that I actually didn't use, I was uh, browsing Craigslist list and I found and this was many many years ago but I found an old Mac uh, laptop it was a black one so I think it was a MacBook and it actually had a lot of different music and video editing programs inside now I didn't need it because I already had a computer of my own with with programs that I used um, and it actually had too much stuff I didn't even use half the programs but I thought and I think it was like $300 and I thought you know what I probably uh, can find someone who would purchase this for more so I bought it for $300 and sold it for 700 so these are two just small examples of things that took very very little of my time um, and to be honest with you I actually find it fun you know so if you are an online shopper or you have like an addiction to like shopping and looking for deals here is how you can actually not spend your money doing it but I mean you spend it temporarily but you actually make more money back and then maybe you can reward yourself with a with a ten dollar treat um, every time you make a sale Another side hustle is an Etsy store. So if you create things, you go to Etsy, make yourself a store, and you can sell uh, you know, everything from handmade items, jewelry, it can even be uh, non-handmade things. I've purchased um, like antiques, like vintage items that people have found probably at garage sales or swap meets on Etsy. It's a great marketplace, and I feel like the people there are looking for those type of unique items, and so you already have like a great uh, community of people who are searching for these types of things. Um, so go to Etsy, check it out, uh, try to avoid, you know, buying too many things yourself. Uh, but look at, you know, just the different stores and different ones that have a lot of reviews, have a lot of people that purchase from them, um, see what it is that they're doing. Number four, which I'm sure everybody's heard of is Airbnb. Uh, if you have a room in your home or a guest room or, or a part of your house that you're not using, maybe your kids have moved out um, and it's just kind of sitting empty, uh, you can rent it out temporarily. And instead of having uh, some there for you know for a year at a time maybe you want to have the freedom of having the whole house to yourself sometimes or your kids come home sometimes they need the space or you need the space sometimes and number five of my top side hustle ideas is to get a side job um, and you might ask what is a side job well um, let's see you can babysit I've babysat for people um, you can do part-time assistant work which I've also done before so you can like run errands for people go get groceries for people depending on what they need um, and where can you find these jobs online on Craigslist actually is a good source of part-time jobs on TaskRabbit um, I have used TaskRabbit for many random things before uh, and on TaskRabbit if you go to the website you can type in what skills or what things you're willing to do you can even wait in line for people um, at I don't know at a store or something to hold their place so all kinds of random things um, you know simple handyman tasks so be sure to check that out if you're an animal lover like me you can do pet sitting, pet walking. There's a lot of websites um, that are a good way of finding potential clients. So you make yourself a profile. Uh, I'll include a couple links, uh, suggestions below so you can check this out. And that's it. So hopefully you enjoy this concise five minute, five side hustle ideas. Please subscribe to see new videos first. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave a comment below, like this video, and I'll see you soon. Bye.